Oh, he's scrapping away. Come on, get. What is going on? I cannot get to. Now you get me there when I don't want there. There we go. What is going on, man? Just will not go. One oh one for the kill. Got this area looted and look and all of the carnage. Oh, wow. Was that some fun, man? That was a good battle there. I liked that a lot. But what is going on here? This is the question mark. So there's actually two question marks in here. Oh, check out the water. I didn't notice that before. That's pretty cool. So we actually have two question marks here. And it looks like an entrance, maybe. Wait, I wanted to grab you. Nah, you can live. We'll let you live. Dude, look at the structure. Are those wide moss or snap moss? Too far away. They look like wide moss. Yeah, yeah, because I, I remember I, th I thought they were hippos. Yeah, I think that's it. There might be some snap moss down inside the water, though. Mm, I can refill my patch with these later. We'll deal with those wide moss later also. All right, how are we getting in here? Cars you can't. Have I been there? I'm thinking not if there's a quest there. Let's check this other side. I didn't notice anything when we were fighting, but I was also fighting, so who knows? I hear scurrying. Aha. Uh -huh. I like it. And before I dive in there, can I make more of these? These were pretty cool. I was liking using these. All right, that's what we got. So there is a perk. Let's take a look. There is a perk that lets you hold more of those. I think it might be under infiltrator. That would make sense. Smoke bomb capacity, yeah. And then I thought I saw down here. That's another capacity. So it's interesting. I can take that other one or this one and it's the same. So that says max four. This said max four also. I'm curious. Well, that's worth one. That I mean, that costs one. This costs two. Will it let me take this? I don't know if, I don't think I want to risk it, but I'm curious. It looks like it will. I guess either way, if I took that other one, that's one point, and then this, that'd be, so that's three total points. I'm curious. I want to see what happens. And then if I come up here, yeah, I guess it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter the order. Do you want to get it up to six? Or what did this unlock? Low profile, reduce your visibility to enemies. So we already have one level. We can, we can increase that even more. That's more of that silent strike heal. What was this? Oh, you know I like that. Why can I not? I can't. You can't go up? Oh, no. I can get this. Yeah, let's do this. 
All right. Might have been a bit of a, a bit much, but we'll do it. Oh, I love the flashlight. I know it's her focus, but I love it. So is this another ruin? What's in here? Blocked path. Dude, so when we were in the main story and it was so dark, why would it why would they not let us turn this on? To give us light. That's actually gonna bug that's gonna bug me and bother me throughout the game if that's the case. See, and then why'd you just take it away? Whoa. Oh, there's the block path. All right. Let's mark it, though. Better leave it alone for now. So I wonder, is that going to be another, like, will that be th because of the story? There is fire gleam somewhere here, though. Right there. All right, so let's get up and at least do the fire it's gleam. Metal flower. Doesn't look like it's blocking the way up, though. Probably get, oh, can we drop down? A lot of rotting wood here. Something heavy might break it down. All right, got an idea. Looks like this was a Karja fort. Might have been abandoned when the Tanakh pushed the Karja army back to Baron Light. Might be worth looking around. No idea where I'm pulling this to, just pulling it. Because we can. All right, we'll figure out where that goes. I might be needing it right there, actually. Yep, that's it. No, nope, I hit grab. Oh, is that not enough? There we go. Whoa, a lot of goods. Although it looks like it was all burned. Looks like it. The gleam, I believe, is right underneath. What's over? Oh, let's lower you. Ignite on my spear to do the trick. Oh, not far enough away. the goodies and I think that's probably it in there right yeah I believe so and everything we're gonna get here until we can do that let's go can we easily get back up yeah there we go let's get this Ooh, what is this going to get us? Oh. Why is that there? Can we not climb up onto the platform? Oh, there we go. Yeah, there was a fire here. The 
This stuff looks to Nox. Oh, something this way. All right, well, I think, let's take a look. That might be, yeah, because the other one would be, the one was the fire gleam and then this other block path. So that's what we're looking at. What are the chances? How far can we glide? One way to find out. Check out this Karja camp. Shake off this wet. Work. There's not much to be gained from it. Aren't they like some highly skilled craftsmen living in some kind of paradise? Living off the land. This is an appointment. That's not an expense. It's just Karja Camp. <laughs> I thought it might have a different name. All right, we have a vendor. Wait, over here. What have you got? Acid warrior, but oh, a shearing. I like the sound of that. Potentially, although 38 is not component tear, it's plus 10%. So is that 38 with that perk? Because that's pretty low, actually. Tool for machine hunters with an improved ability to tear off machine parts. It doesn't seem all that great, to be honest with you. Yeah, I'm not liking either of these, actually. Vertical shock trap. Deals 200 shock damage, deals 200 shock build up. We'll take one. Two. We'll take two. We'll give it a try. Resources. Yeah, I don't want to do anything there. I know we have some stuff to sell, some resources. Uh, just a little bit, not much, actually. I thought we had a little more than that. A new coal for the fire. You'll burn fiercer with that in you. Vertical shot traps are now available to craft and place. These special traps can damage flying targets, oh, as well as enemies on the ground and will stun vulnerable targets with shock damage. That's great for all those uh, flying enemies. Oh, yeah, sure. Sister! Over here! I'll take care of what you lend me to. Okay. Your compassion warms my flesh. Um, I think there's just maybe this quest giver. Oh, our stash. Let's open that up. See what we can pull out. That might be helpful. There we go. Not a whole lot, but a little bit. All right, let's see what's going on here. You told me they were the best delving crew in the claim. Y you told me we'd be drowning in artifacts. Well, I found this, didn't I? It's a tray. By the sun, man. Not even the most accomplished crafters of Meridian could pull off such symmetry. I wonder what the old ones served on it. Appetizers? Seafood? It's a tray. It's a mousetrap, right? Who are you? Rushavid. You wouldn't recognize the sun if it hit you in the face. This is the savior of Maybe Indian, not. the one who sees the unseen. You've come for them, haven't you? Uh, them? The relics. The lake is full of them. Something big happened here in ancient times. Do you mind if I take a look? That's a lot of data. Um, should we be sending for a healer? <laughs> Whatever this is, it all points to something called a mobile cover system. Oh, you mean a cover for the tray? No, more like something that could come handy in a fight. Where did you find this? Uh, the dig site, uh, which is now crawling with machines. And unless they magically disappear, we are leaving. Don't you want to find out what actually happened here? Maybe we still can. I'm interested. Stealth? So the guy on the left, I think his name was Rushavid. 
That name sounds familiar, like you might have been in the first game, but he doesn't look familiar. What drew you to this place in particular? Every good expedition starts with a rumor. When the Tanakh chased our forces out of the West, returning soldiers described this lake, rife with signs of the ancients. I knew as soon as I heard the tales that its waters promise a bounty of artifacts. A promise that hasn't been kept, at least so far. Those who are patient will be rewarded with sunlight when clouds pass. There's plenty of ruins in the east. Why come all the way out here to look for artifacts? Ah, well, while my colleagues scour the same old ruins, I intend to blaze a new trail. Loquacious Gendas, the first scholar to discover the secrets of the West. <laughs> Why, I'll be as famous as the great scribe Aram. You don't seem to share his optimism. I sell artifacts to nobles. Ideally, trinkets that are a little more glamorous than seafood trays. You can be so boorish. Somebody's got to pay for expeditions like these, and so far we haven't found anything that'll cover my costs. So you got attacked by machines at your dig site? It was horrifying. When we arrived, the site seemed as calm as a gentle breeze. I, I saw a glint in the water and waded in. It was the tray. I was so enamored with it, I didn't even see the machines closing in. I barely escaped with my life. I was there. You actually had a pretty good head start on them. <laughs> Easy for you to say, gawking from a safe distance. In any event, I had hoped the Asaram would deal with them. They're supposed to be the best delving crew in the claim. Instead, all they do is moan about hazard pay. <laughs> <laughs> Not a chance, unless we can find some booty to cover my investment. If we go looking for this and we find stealth tech, we want it. Where's this dig site? Seems like the best place to start if I'm going to follow up on this mobile cover system. Maybe I can figure out what actually happened here. The site is just behind us, up the lake to the west. I knew it was no coincidence our paths crossed, Savior. Imagine what stories you'll bring us once you search the lake with your second sight. Hopefully just the truth. The sun has truly Whoa. shined upon us this day. Drowned hopes. Uh, let's see, a pair of cartridge academics seek to return to the dig site so they may continue their search for relics. Uh, so go to the coordinates for the cons. Oh. Wait a minute. Did we already do one of these? No. No, yes, we did. We already, well, we tried to, but I think this, that must be a uh, metal flower though. So we may not be able to do that until, cause there's this, go to the dig site. Search the ruins for security console. Yeah, we need to be able to clear those metal flowers. Could this quest lead us to do that? What's the what's the potential of that? Or is that going to be story related? Like the fire gleam. I'm not going to lie. I am interested in checking it out. Let's I should go to that dig site Gendis mentioned. Clear out those machines and look for any clues on this mobile car. Let's take a look. Also, I wouldn't mind trying to mess around with how to fight underwater. No spear, we cannot pull out a bow. All right, let's get this and get back up. Oh my, let's get back down. He's on to us. Down. <laughs> that seems to be the game plan right now. Jeez. 
Jagged del Deep Delve. Oh, I actually thought this was going to be underwater. <laughs> Why did I think that? Oh. Can't override that now. I need to get data from the cauldron if I can find one. Are you just normal scrappers? Looks like it. What about you? Oh, you're a wide maw. Do we have any of... We do. Can I craft anymore? I can't. Uh, I think I think five's a good start. Two wine moths and the scrapper. Now, where did you come from? Let's come back here. The scrapper's on to me. Yeah, he is. Oh, we can try getting up top, maybe? I've not really done that. And I know it just knocks you. You're going to get knocked off. I don't think we can stealth, completely stealth kill this guy. I don't think that's going to be a thing. Whoa. Why are we sliding out? All right, so you actually go back around that way. You're going back to your scrap pile. All right, let's throw down here. And oh, there's another scrapper down below. Let's do this. See, I need to increase that. I can only do two right now. That needs to be increased. And get out. I guess we could get into this grass, maybe? Oh, I don't think it's smart. I don't think it's smart. Got you. Let's get you. See, because he's a little cautious. I need you to go to the purge water. This guy definitely does. All right, he's back on. He's back on. I mean, that did a lot of damage, but uh, he's got a lot of health. And it doesn't help when you miss. I'm out of stamina already. How about the other purge water? Oh, no. There we go. Drenched. And on the ammo, come on, craft it up, craft it up. His buddy did not seem to like come to his aid and neither did the other scrapper. That's kind of interesting. We're able to take him on solo. Did we not knock anything off except for a rock and another rock? We did not knock anything off of him. Can we get a stealth from above? Is that a thing? Wait. Uh, it's too late now.
It was too late. It popped up for a moment. On me. I can send it to my stash. All right, so now we have just you. I want to try this. Although, I mean, I should just do the purge water. It works. We need a purge water sling. All right, we're trying it. Oh, he's checking out his scrapper friend. Lay you down and get out. Not a good, whoa, 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 he's sucking me in. I didn't know that was a thing. He was sucking me in. No, we need you to come over here. Not the best of spots for that purge water. Load you up. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. We should be double notched right now. Come on. There we go. Oh, he docked a little bit. How's that possible? Dude, he's sucking me in. That is cool. I mean, it sucks, but it's cool. Oh, he's quick. Quick on the draw. Well, quick on his feet, actually, but that's all right. You know what I meant? Nope, not getting it, not getting it. Get out, get out. Dude, that could cause some havoc. If there are multiples and you're fighting and you don't know where one guy is, that can cause some issues. Come on, buddy, come for the purge water. I got a little bit of protection here. Come on, there we go. Can I get anything Don't off have of you? Yet. Oh, and no ammo. And no ammo. There we go. That's fine. Yeah, we need to be able to get. There's got to be something that allows us to. Look at the ruins under the water. See if I can find any clues. There's got to be something that allows us to uh, hold our breath longer underwater. So I did notice when we were out on the stamina, it did come back a lot quicker. Oh, I think I still need to. No, I got you already. So I did notice that. So that was well worth it. Cause that first time it was happening, I just could not get that stamina back for anything. Ooh, barely got that. And she's right, there's not much here, except for rocks. And a couple crates. Those are some goodies. See, I thought we were going down into the water. So is that the two then? Well, now it turned into one. Let's take a look at the quest. Uh, investigate the submerged ruins and then search the ruins for security console. Search the ruins for security console. Yeah, I don't think we're actually going to be able to finish this. Because I think we need to be able to take out the metal flowers. But if we can get some goodies. 
Yeah, those are some goodies. And not upset the local wildlife. That would be good. See, I'm also, I'm scared of getting caught somewhere. See, like that, I'm getting caught, there we go. Get that breath and down. That's just the weed oil. Let's start focusing a little more on... Where's the ruin at? Oh, I got completely turned around. The water makes me nervous. There was something jammed in that console underwater. But I can't hold my breath long enough to yank it out. Yeah, right there tells you. I think we're going to have to hold off on continuing this. Yeah, I, th I think that's the deal. We need to find a way to hold our breath longer. Maybe do we get, is it possible to get a rebreather or something? I don't know. Oh, there's another barrel up top. Let's grab that. And nothing. Sweet. Okay, let's take a look at our map. And yeah, I delayed that for a bit. <laughs> let's let's see what's in the area. We know we've already done that. We've already done we know stone's echo. This was, that's a metal flower, so we cannot do that. Whoa, look at this out here into the water. That's pretty far out. Oh no, that's gotta be, I think that's in the water or up on land on the other side of the water. Let's check this out. Let's see what we have. Let's, we'll find something along the way. Nice little bath. I'm still using that way too much. I hate using pulse. I really need to break that habit. Maybe if we're, when we're main story, or even if we're just, um, you know, in a, in a room and just make sure I have the room. But I need to break that habit because I need to be able to, to notice it on my own. Now, those are glint hawks. Too far away. I'm pretty sure that's a glint hawk. And a burrower. Yeah, fire glint hawk. I want to be focusing here, though. Let's keep running. Skyrim. Oh, what's back in here? What is this? Oh, it's a boar. I thought it was maybe some other animal that I hadn't seen. Because there are some uh, animals in for some upgrades for weapons and outfits that we have not seen yet. All right. Whoa. All right. I'm not going back there. 
That's the edge of the map. That is long distance. Where'd it go? There it is. Keep my eyes open. Oh, you know what? My controller just died. <laughs> One second. And I'm back. I was wondering why I was not able to do anything. I was trying to jump. I was trying to move and like, what is going on? Not able to do anything at all. But look at this. Oh, I thought I was going to land. I was trying to land in the water. Did not work out too well look at the current it's taking me oh that's pretty cool and it doesn't even look like there really is a current right now actually though is that is that a cave right there well there's nowhere to go under so all right too too shallow Wonder if that's a cave. That looks like that could be if it is, if it's whatever it is. Could be what we're looking for. No, I don't think that's anything, but what we're looking for, I think is gonna be, yeah, it's still kind of on the other side of this, I think, I believe. A little too far, there we go. Whoa. Now that, maybe that was, maybe I was wrong. Maybe that was a cave, yeah. Can we climb you? Yes, we can. And we can do this, nice. Let's get this fire room out of here. Oh my, look at that green shine. That's a chunk. Wow. I didn't even know chunks were a thing. Are you anything? I don't think so. No, I think, you know what? I think that's just light. There's like holes. I think mean, it's just light coming through. All right, what's on this? Oh, there is no nothing. So maybe it was just that chunk and that was it. Or, and this box. Although we can get, oh, that's just a way out maybe? Or is it, is there something else up here? No, this is the way we came in. No, it's not. That's not the way we came in. Anything else? I think that's it, but we got ourselves our first green shine 
Chunk.